Living True Channel, Living True Channel, how you guys doing tonight? Alright, alright, sound like you guys are doing blessed. Sound like you guys are doing blessed. That's always a blessing, you guys. That's always a blessing. Living True Channel, I just wanted to answer this question. A guy on Facebook asked me, <clears throat> more like, wanted my opinion on why everybody's saying that the rapture will not happen. I get that, and I do see that a lot. People saying the rapture is not going to happen. To me, my opinion on that, you guys know that's false to me. Most people that say that the rapture is not going to happen to me are those people that is in love with this world. They don't want to come to grips with what is happening. Like God said in the word, how is it that you can discern when a storm is coming, but you can't discern the times that we are living in? God gave us things to look for when the end times will be. And the things he gave us to look forward to, earthquakes and all that, is happening right before our eyes. People say it's not happening. A lot of people, <coughs> excuse me, a lot of people ain't reading the, reading the paper, watching the news doing those things people think just because it's not happening around them that things are not happening in this world and i would like to say those people are the same people that's in love with this world and hope that this world will not come to an end or jesus will not come because they are not ready but the times now we all fight with sin each and every day but it's time to now is to overcome the sin <clears throat> it's no more time to be waiting and lollygagging and saying putting it off to the next day I will do it the next day then it becomes the next day then before you know it's been a week then you'll before you know it'll be a month it's the time is now to get closer with the most high the rapture will happen you gotta believe it believe in the sun Repent of your sins daily. A lot of people, first thing they do when they wake up, check their phones. How about first thing you do is checking with Jesus, saying a prayer, repenting of all your sins. It's not that hard, you guys. Getting to know Jesus Christ is the best thing you can do for yourself. God gave us life. What have you got? gave God lately? What have you done for the Lord lately? Something to think about, you guys. You guys, we got to take that into consideration and acknowledge the King. Be aware of the times we are living in. The rapture will happen. We shall all be caught up, but the dead in Christ shall rise first. Then those who are left and remain shall be caught up in the air to meet the Lord. We just got to understand these things and don't be lacking and don't be underestimating the time. So I got another year or so. I got another two years. I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing. I got to get this out my system. Your system is about to be coming to a dramatic change, a dramatic stop. Your system is about to be over with. Your system that you living in and stuck in, is it, it, it's not going to exist too longer. And then you're going to be finding yourself left behind saying I should have did it then I should have did it now we all had them things that we wish we had did sooner than soon and we ended up missing our opportunity do not miss the rapture I love you guys always if you guys not check out my new song you guys check it out and I love you guys always like share comment subscribe you guys one love shout out to my living true family Love you guys. To God be the glory. He died for me, so I thank him. The devil ain't on me, I shake him. The lion and the lamb is the great one. For Jesus, yes, I'll take one. Oh, I thank him. Oh, I thank him. Oh, I thank him. Oh, I thank him. Oh, I thank him.